This is the brand new OrCam MyEye Pro. It's the latest in OrCam's line of devices and along with its already impressive array of features such as color identification, barcode scanning, product identification, facial recognition, and of course, OrCam's award-winning text-to-speech OCR, the MyEye Pro brings some new impressive features such as smart reading, orientation, and a new companion app, all of which we will talk about today. So hang out, we will be right back. Okay, before we get into talking about the new MyEye Pro, if this is your first time to my channel, welcome. My name is Sam. I make videos about living life with vision impairment, tips and tricks videos, how-to videos, and an emphasis on assistive technology that can help make our lives awesome. So if that sounds interesting to you, please consider hitting the subscribe button and turning on notifications. I post a new video every single Saturday. And I'd like to thank the sponsor of today's video, OrCam, for sending out the MyEye Pro so that I can make this video for you guys. Now, I don't get to keep the device and OrCam isn't influencing anything I say about it. All right, so I'm really excited to talk to you guys about all the new features on the OrCam MyEye Pro. But before we do that, I figured we should touch on the original features. I guess you could say older features, although saying older doesn't make them any less impressive than the new features. Let's see if we can identify some colors. Yellow, brown area. Yellow, all right. Blue, turquoise area. Blue, turquoise area, probably is. I don't know, my colors are terrible. <laughs> Next, we've got barcode scanning and product identification. Now, these can be very similar, but they could also be used in very different ways. Kroger, tea, drink, mix, peach. Complete pancake and waffle mix. Garlic and olive oil 5.8 ounce paper box. Next, I want to give you an example of the facial recognition and how, especially right now, it could come in very handy. Hey, Sam. Your neighbor, Van. Hey, Van, what's up, man? Awesome, nothing big. All right, see you, man. <laughs> see you, buddy. Another one of the very useful features that it has is identifying money, identifying currency. There you go. <laughs> Finally, OrCam's award-winning text-to-speech OCR engine. Now, let's talk about the newest features for the OrCam MyEye Pro. This includes smart reading and orientation. I did a short demonstration of a smart reading in my OrCam Read video. If you'd like to learn more about that device, click on the link popping out of the screen right now or in the description down below. But smart reading uses AI, artificial intelligence, and allows you to interact with the document, with the text, to get more information, get specific information. So here are a few situations where this might be very helpful. Smart reading. Note that some of the text was unreadable. Ready. Read phone numbers. Found one phone number to place a carry out order see all two six nine six four four zero 
read amounts. Found 11 amounts. First result, $7.99. Second result, $7.99. Third result. Smart reading. Read headlines. Found two headlines. First result, crickets for Carlton remembering artist Carlton Wing by Johnny Lackey. Second result, to Sandy, with love remembering a fierce warrior by Aaron Chandler. Read second article. To Sandy, with love remembering a fierce warrior by Aaron Chandler. Andy Davis, a Boston artist stationed for years in Versailles, Kentucky, left this world on June 14th. I say so. Read first article. Crickets for Carlton remembering artist Carlton Wing by Johnny Lackey, Guardian Angels, and Wednesday, March 25th, Lexington artist Carlton Wing shared the news Wing had been a lifelong IBM, and then I am listening. Exit. Exiting. And then the other new feature is orientation. This is where the device will give you information about the scene in front of you and help you locate important items. So items like chairs, tables, doorways, uh, screens like a computer screen or a TV screen. You snap a picture of what's in front of you and the MyEye Pro will orientate you as to where those things are. What's in front of me? A chair in the center and a screen to the right and a table to the right. I feel weird just sitting here with glasses on for this entire video. <laughs> I don't usually wear glasses, so it's kind of strange to me. So I really wanted the bulk of this video to be about the features, uh, but I figured I should probably give you guys a little more information about the device itself and the hardware. Incidentally, if you'd like to learn more, I definitely recommend watching my other videos on this device or the predecessor of this device, the OrCam My Eye 2. The Pro is basically the same device with more features. But the device itself reminds me a lot of just a little flash drive. Uh, it's small. It's about the size of a lipstick container. It magnetically sits onto the bracket that you can attach on any size pair of glasses. In the box, you actually get these window pane glasses. Uh, for someone like me that doesn't wear glasses, these are great. You also get some extra brackets, which will allow you to put them on any of your glasses. There's only one button on the device. That's the power button. It's also the button you press to put it to sleep. Everything else is done either with swipes and taps on the touchpad or with voice commands or through the app. So real quickly, I just wanted to show you the companion app. I believe this app is currently only available for iOS devices. Uh, the app is connected by via Bluetooth, so you, if you get too far away, it will disconnect. But as it says, we have a battery indicator at the top here, and then we have a couple large high contrast buttons. Finds my eye button. First one is find my eye. So if I were to tap this, then the device, the My Eye Pro, will start to beep or sound an alarm, alerting me to where it is. I'll show you guys. Find my eye. Stop searching. Button. So. Stop searching. Find my eye. Does a train sound and uh, until you click that button to stop. So that can be pretty handy if you lose track of where your device is. Learn. Button. Learn is a button that takes you into, it's a shortcut that takes you into a ton of tutorial videos, videos that go over all the different features of the device. Very, very helpful videos. I watched a bunch of them uh, just to get more familiar with the device and it worked, they work great. So I definitely recommend that. Settings. Button. settings is a fantastic way to customize or to adjust the settings of the device. Settings, my eye settings. So you can do all of this through the device using the touchpad and voice commands, but it's just much easier to do it on here. Reading rate, 200. So for example, the reading rate. Reading rate, 200. Adjustable. If I were to swipe up. Reading rate, 
rate 720 words per minute. There you go. You hear that it adjusted on the device instantly. So lots of settings in here, and in my opinion, a much easier way to adjust those. Finally, we have control. Please. And this is, once again, I think an easy way to control the device. So if I were to hit the play button, it's going to snap a picture. Please. There you go. Uh, if it were reading out text, I could fast forward, rewind, all of that, stop it just from the controls here, these large, high contrast, easy to navigate buttons. So that's a quick look at the very helpful companion app. Okay guys, well, I hope you enjoyed all of those demonstrations showing how all the different features of the new OrCam MyEye Pro showing them in mostly real world situations. As I said at the beginning, this isn't really a review video. It's more of a demonstration showing you guys what the device can do and hopefully how it could be helpful in your everyday life. It's my job to show you these devices, give you the information about what they do, where you can find them, and I leave it up to you to decide if it's gonna be the right fit for you personally. I will mention that the OrCam MyEye Pro does support multiple languages. Uh, what particular languages you get on your device is dependent on your choice. They allow you to mix and match the features that you want on your device. And so you only pay for the ones you want. Uh, because of that, I can't exactly tell you how much the, the device costs. I recommend you reach out to OrCam, to their sales team, to get more information about that. Probably giving them a phone call. That's probably the easiest way to do it. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. Once again, a huge thank you to the sponsor of today's video, OrCam. And a huge thank you to you guys for checking it out. All of the contact information will be listed down below not just for the U.S., but internationally as well. If you have questions for me, if there's anything I can help with, please let me know in the comments down below or by sending me an email, vblindlifesam at gmail.com. Don't forget about the VIP t-shirts available in my Amazon and Teespring shop. Those links are also down below. Please like the video if you found this information helpful. Don't forget to subscribe, turn on notifications. I post a new video every single Saturday. As always, guys, Sam with the Blind Life, I'll see you next time. Shutting down, please wait. Power off. Bye bye.